ask Tom on Home Show. Lawrence from Stafford, Texas has a question about an AC upgrade. Well, he's looking, he's shopping for a new system for his 2004 home. Tom, it's a two-story house, and uh, Lawrence writes to us, My current AC runs too long, and I'm told it's working too hard, than, or harder than it needs to. Uh, the cost kind of surprised me, though. The AC guy's quotes run from twenty-five to forty-five thousand dollars for a new system. A sixteen sear is the lowest cost. A seventeen sear, which has humidity systems kind of in the middle, and finally the twenty sear system is the best and of obviously the most costly. I want to upgrade a, to a smart house kind of Nest Learning thermostat for better efficiency. What do you think, Tom? Does it make a difference which one he gets? Well, it makes a difference out of your pocketbook, but I want to go back to the comment, and then obviously he'll do what he feels is right to do. Uh, first off, Nest thermostats can go on any of them, as far as I know, unless you got some odd situation. So I don't know how smart that is, but if you like playing with it, I know Charlie, you like yours. I have mixed uh, motions from different or mixed uh, comments from different people. Some people do, some people don't. That's that's fine. Uh, but he says his original one is working; it just runs too long. That doesn't make sense to me because they're supposed to run longer to dehumidify. If they cycle too quickly, then you get that cold, clammy feel. You don't get dehumidification. So that comment to me stuck out real fast that there's nothing wrong with your unit. So I would get a second opinion to make sure if you even knew one because it doesn't make any sense that somebody said it would run too long. Now, if it has a hard startup and the unit's running fine, you're comfortable, your humidity levels are good, your energy uh, uh, costs are in line with everybody else because you're not going to save a lot go upgrading all this equipment, then I would tell you don't do it at all. And if you need to, you can put a hard start kit on the startup so it starts mm -hmm. up easy. That's only uh, like 400 bucks or something. It's not 25,000, <laughs> for sure. But... Yeah. Would I go to a 20 with all that uh, equipment on there? That's not smart. That's a lot of equipment you have to maintain. So I would not go to a SEER 20. First off, SEER ratings in the Houston area mean very little because that's why you have to have a dehumidification uh, system on there because the air conditioner is not going to do it. But an air conditioner should do it and do both. So to have extra equipment to dehumidify makes no sense to me. As far as the 17 over the 16, go with the least expensive. 16s now are getting to be base model 14 to 16, depending what brand you're dealing with. I'm fine with that. I would just get a single stage unit first off from 2004 to today. It's going to be so much more efficient, even if you get a base unit than the one you have now. So energy savings, it'll be there. will be millions of dollars. No, because we don't pay that much for energy. But I think if you're going to get a new one, if you feel you need one, don't spend all the money on the extras. Nest thermostat on any one you have, including the one you already have. And I don't know if I'd switch the one I have out because it mm -hmm. seems to be running fine. This sounds like it's a case of asking a barber if you need a haircut. Well, uh, yes. And, and I got one today, by the way. Uh, and I did need it. And he said, you sure? <laughs> no, anyway. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Uh, wait a minute. Wait, wait, hold on. Hold, hold, not, so not so fast. Hold on. You got a haircut. Was that exploratory surgery? <laughs> yeah. I've had okay. that before, too. <laughs> but not on that. That, that was just, anyway. Mm -hmm. What I wanted to say is you buy that SEER 20, right? You spend $45,000. You get all the bells and whistles. I will guarantee you when the warranty's out and your, your technician comes over and he says, you know the system's 10 years old, it's out of warranty. You should consider getting a new one. I don't care what unit you have. You're still going to get the pitch. It's part of the game. Don't play the game. Get the grants you can trust. Click on Ask Tom right there at homeshowradio.com. You can fill out a form, send us a picture, send us your question, send us whatever you want to share with us so Tom can give you an answer because he wants to help you and you can take advantage of his uh, knowledge because uh, we post a new one of these every day. We answer them here and on early edition on Sunday mornings and on our Facebook live show. Regardless, you'll find videos like this one waiting for you at homeshowradio.com, our Facebook page, and our YouTube channel.